Come on, Xerax. I know you want some. Come on, Xerax, Xerax. Back everybody to Imperion Galactic Survival. I'm Know It All DM. How's everybody doing today? I'm doing absolutely wonderful today. Today I'm hanging out with my uh, ARV playthrough, my advanced recon vanguard in a middle of a snowstorm. They call it light snow, but you see you've got plasma lightning all over, which is weird. But uh, anyway, uh, last episode I went out and did some mining. Um, I did die once, but I don't. I didn't show it on camera because I was standing up there g gathering some sathium, and instead of putting down the uh, the temperature control unit, I uh, was trying to use my uh, SOV because I didn't have a whole lot left in it. Well, as you can see, if the SOV is not powered on, it doesn't actually <laughs> um, doesn't actually keep you warm. So I kind of froze to death. But uh, that aside, uh, today I've got some great plans. Oh, I went ahead and uh, colorized some things and uh, retexturized this, which I had to replace uh, last time because I accidentally removed it when I was taking apart the uh, so the previous SOV and replacing it with a brand new one. Um, I don't know if I showed that either, um, but I took it apart because it had gotten damaged by the... Uh, the drone over there is that drone or it got damaged by something severely so I took it apart and rebuilt it but I uh, anyway so now that I am almost level seven take that off I was doing some uh, debugging in uh, creative mode a second ago so sorry about that um, but I uh, yeah now that I've I'm almost level seven I've got I uh, you know, I, I, I'm almost there. I want to get to level 7 and start to build the ARV SOV Mark III B. Which, you know, I know that's a mouthful, but that is the first small vessel. The cheapest small vessel that I can get. I could go for the ARV Falcon, which uh, is a small vessel with a warp drive. But I'm not ready for that yet. I don't have all the cobalt I need for that and everything. I did get a little bit of cobalt and sathium. I, uh, when I, I, uh, I put, uh, something into my, uh, factory last episode, uh, something that I looted off of the, uh, thing over there, it was, uh, a capacitor device, um, gave me sathium and cobalt back, so I've got some of that, and what I need, let's see, what do I need for the SOV beta? Um... I need 50 more copper, so let's just go ahead and for 50 more copper, I'm going to need 25 electronics. So that will give me, I, uh, and, and it does it two at a time, so it'll give me 50 electronics, which uses 50 copper and 25 silicone. Uh, when it comes to silicone... Uh, that'll add 25 on to there. That'll be, uh, what, 94? That'll be more than, should be, no. Yeah, should be more than enough for, uh, the silicone that I need. Cobalt, I need 34. Let's go ahead. I've got one cobalt alloy here. Um, I also am going to need some iron. So let's go ahead. What uses cobalt? This uses cobalt ingots. And that uses cobalt and sathium. I put that in there. It'll return the sathium to me and the neodymium. Let's just use cobalt this. So I've got three. And I need a total of 34. So can I do 10 more? Well, let's do nine more. And then add an additional thing in there. Alright, so let's go ahead. Put the electronics in here. 
Bam. Copper and silicone taken care of. I'm going to need a little bit more iron once I get these done. These cobalt alloys ought to give me what I need. That's 10. That'll give me 30. Let me do one more cobalt alloy to make it 33. And then one cobalt ingot. Um, I'm already down to one second, so I can actually just go ahead and throw the iron ingots in there. Um, I need, what is that, 22 more? No, 32 more. Um, I've got iron here, so if I do 10, 20, 30, because it does it 10 at a time. And if I put this in here, bam, perfect numbers except for silicone, which is way over, but that's fine. Um, now I can't go ahead and spawn it in because I'm not high enough level, but I want to go ahead, do a little scouting in this. Um, I know there was a drone over near that copper deposit. So we're going to head over there and try to take out, what was it, a rocket drone, I believe. I don't have any food. I need to get some food on the way, so we're going to probably, there's where that silicone deposit was. Um, I'm probably going to stop on the way over there and kill some beasties that are over here, if I can find any. There's one. Ooh, that's what I like. That's right. Just line up. Run, babies, run! And now I can get some milk and some food, and I fell off my SOV. Ooh, that's giving me lots of meat. Nice. My drone knocked me off. Okay. Well. And I'll put the milk in the refrigerator. Where's fridge? Oh, I don't have a fridge, do I? I need to put a fridge on this thing. Um, but that's fine. That's fine. I'll just go ahead and uh, hold on to the milk. Mobile constructor. Body temperature goes down. Uh, let's go ahead and go all into steaks. So I should be good with that. If the milk starts to spoil, that'll be fine. But look at all those. Yeah, I don't need to worry about thinning their herd population. Not at all. Okay, copper deposit over this away. Okay. Okay, it's a rocket drone. Do not rocket me. Do not rocket me. Let me shoot your face. I can't really aim too well. Let me get a high ground. Let me get a high ground. Yeah, up here. Fighting in this thing is a little difficult. Come on. Do not hit me. You are not allowed to blow me up. Here we go. Here we go. There you go. Nice. Okay. Let's come on up here. Give me your things. Alright. Let's open up the constructor. Go ahead and put all that in there. Give me this. Feed me. I'm going to go ahead and drink these so they don't 
boil because they go bad relatively quickly. But I'm going to put those on there and we're going to keep on looking. So let's see what I want to do. I want to come down and search this area, then back up to the home. Um, so that would be these directions, south, southeast. And if I find anything worth killing, I'll kill it on the way. I'm almost to level seven. Why does that sound like a tauntaun? Stand up. Okay. What do we got out here? Is that my... Yeah, that's where I want to be. It's down this way. Ooh. I see a drone over there. And it looks like some sort of structure. I don't want to get too close to it. Just close enough to identify it. Vehicle port. Nice. Do not shoot at me. Do not shoot at me, vehicle port. I am just passing by. I am not causing you any trouble yet. I think it wants to shoot at me. It's got a lot of drones around it, too. I don't know if a... Uh, SOV small vessel can take it out it, uh, vehicle ports if I'm not mistaken only have two turrets though so it shouldn't be that big of a problem especially because of the way that the SOVs fight um, which I will you know, show you that once I get it built um, let's see what do I need I just need some more XP's Killing, killing parasaurs. Do babies give me XP's? They give me a little bit. And then they turn giant. Okay. I don't know why one turret seems to run out, or one gun seems to run out faster than the other. It's weird. All right, let's check over here, see if there's any bad things to kill. If not, I'll just kill more Parasaur. Because bad things give me lots of XPs. I'm almost there. One large bad thing ought to give me, you know, like, like a Golem or a Scorpion Dude. Anything like that ought to, you know, be good. Heck, maybe even if I find a drone. One of the bigger drones would give me enough. Don't think one of the smaller ones would. I'm not seeing anything. Nothing. Nothing at all. Alright, let's see what's over this way. More parasaurs. Zoop. 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 Ha ha! Alright, lizard muleys, I know you're down here. Lizard muley, lizard muley. Fine, we'll just. Ah, there you are. There we go. I don't know why I went ahead and killed that last one. I didn't need to. Oh, I could have killed you. I could have killed you. You actually have good stuff on you. SOV Mark 3B. Right there. Small vessel. Ha <laughs> ha. Now, of course, it looks, you know, almost identical to the uh, Mark 1A. But... Uh, let's go ahead 
put some oxygens in you. That's from the uh, thing. I need to get some fuel. Fuel box right here. Actually, let's go ahead and just do that. Okay. Let's get in you. Now, you do have a refrigerator. A uh, cargo box. Put this in the cargo box. I'm going to go ahead and put everything else in here. Not the water. Water goes in here. Actually, yeah, water needs to go in here. Okay. And I'll move half of these into there. Now, what I need, I need some ammo for it. Let's see, if I do that, that'll probably use up all my Promethium and iron. I don't have a whole lot of iron left, so let us do this. Um, ammo box. And your ammo box is right there. All right. Uh, the refrigerator's there. The armor locker is over here, which the Mark I didn't have an armor locker. So let's just do a little bit of exploration. I'm going to look around a bit, and uh, yeah, I'll come back when it's time to assault the... Uh, uh, time to assault the uh, vehicle port. All right, so now it's morning or near enough. I'm going to go ahead and activate flight systems. Turn on lights. And uh, what say you uh, to us going after this vehicle port here? Yeah, we got what? Four drones to deal with and some turrets. get me here. I'm confusing the turrets by uh, flying above them and doing little strange turn maneuvers. Because of the way that I'm flying, it's getting all confused. Taking out the turrets is my primary goal because I, am I even in range? I think I am. Whoa, nope, nope, let's uh, come over this way. Yeah. the uh, drones relatively easily. Ooh, took one hit. Go ahead and reload. You should be going down relatively soon. There's one turret. Now we just gotta worry about this. Was this an ion cannon? Alright, ion cannon down. Now it's time to worry about the drones. Start with the large minigun drone. Oh, 
large minigun drone seems to like taking damage. There's the large minigun drone. The rest of these ought to be relatively easy. Plasma drone. And one more plasma drone to take out. Okay. Let's see. Did I lose any? Uh, it looks like I just took a little teeny tiny bit of damage. All right. Let us level out and park over here to the side. Let's park. In fact, let's go ahead and just land right here on top of this here. While it's not terribly cold. And let's see if I can send my drone to gather these. Okay. Nice. And then I don't know if that plasma drone is close enough. I might have to. That one over there, I'm definitely going to have to get. There we go. Okay, now I can come back in here and fly out over to here and grab this one. Then I'm going to make my way into the vehicle bay of the vehicle port. There are, uh, if I'm not mistaken, there are some uh, turret drones in there or over there that need to be taken out. And you, okay, and then, perfect. Let's come in here and see what I can do here. Okay, whoa. Um, there. Okay. What do we got in here? We got some stuff. And you have stuff. And you have stuff. And you have stuff. Alright. Let's put all this stuff that we just got in the constructor here. Except for the ammo. I'll hold on to that. Now, if I needed to, I could pro probably repair anything on my ship. Speaking of repairs, I know I took a hit, but I don't think I took too bad of one. Let's see, are you at 100? You're at 99. There's something damaged that. Okay, I think that might be it there. Okay, 100%. Cool. So, the next thing I want to do is get through that door. It's an armored door, so I'm just going to have to... Xerax. I know you want some. Come on, Xerax, Xerax. Any more? All right, let's go find that spawner.
Okay, I think that is the only spawner. Nice. Let's... Alright, I'm gonna come over this way. And start looting over this way first. Now, I did see that elevator. Okay. Oh, it gave me more shotgun ammo. Nice. And I do hear more enemies up there. Upgrade kits. Nice. And then I think the core is through there. Alright, so this level... Oh, I forgot to loot all these Xerax. Can I only loot one? Nah. Ooh, nice. Okay. I think that's all of them. Once I loot them, they tend to uh, disappear. Okay. So let's go ahead and put all this in here. Um, I'll hold on to the medicines. Um, let's put. those in there. Wait, why am I doing that? Uh, level out. Land. I can just do this. There is no O2 in the tanks. Well, we can fix that. I think. If we brought O2. We did not bring any O2. Alright, well, I guess I will have to use... Well, let's see. If I put... This says 50. If I do that, it only does 35. And if I do this... Yeah. It's easier just to do this. Okay. Now, the enemies that are left, we've got this group of people up here, which I should be able to take care of. Let's see, from this side. know if I got I didn't get all the spawners did I get all the creatures I think I got all the creatures I need to go in there and grab us and get a spawner and there are turds all right there's a turd on the other side if I come around here Nice. Looks like there were only two that spawned from these things up here. Um, could have swore there were like cargo boxes or something up here. Oh, there they are. Ooh, nice power coils. Lots and lots of food. Good, good, good. 
All right, let's go ahead and put that in here. Not that. Let's keep some veggies on me. Mobile constructor can take all of these. And I'll hold the rest of this on me just in case. Now, the only place left to go is into the core room, which is there. I think the only the only way to get into here since I uh, since I used up the uh, like I can't bring the ammo here is to blow the sucker. And now let's bring this down around here because I'm sure those things are going to want a little payback. Whether it's the Xerax or the uh, droids, I'm not positive what's in there because they updated this recently. Oh, Xerax. Oi, Xerax, where'd you go? Okay, now before they respawn, hopefully there was only one spawner. Let's go take out their spawner. Nice. Okay. So that's that. Okay. Taking out those things. Now I should be able to just grab stuff from here. Perfect. What happens if I grab these? Hardened steel plates. Nice. Ooh. I'm going to have to come back and... things okay overall this has been a successful looting uh, job I got a lot of materials even some rare materials I got a lot of uh, a lot more of these so I can start working on a garden I got some hardened steel plates which this early on are really nice um, If I take these apart, yeah, it gives me steel plates and hardened steel plates. Nice. And I might just want to come back and take this place apart to get hardened steel plates. Because hardened steel plates, hardened steel plates are really nice. Now I could have swore that they uh, w that they had it so it gave ingots, like that gave ingots. That's weird. All right. Um, don't know why I'm not just going through the wall, but okay. You, you might want to uh, turn off your flight systems and your lights. Just a little hint. Uh, 
constructor. And an auto minor core. Nice. Uh, cargo box. I had a uh, higher tier. Can I learn? No, multi tier tool, tool, not yet. But I can learn the drill. That's something I'm definitely going to want. Um, miscellaneous. I can't get that yet. And I can't get that yet. Or that. So I'm not really going to worry about those for now. Um, let's see, if I come up here, a lot of this stuff is just plastic stuff. Ooh, too cold. Alright, let's go downstairs. Okay, you ought to warm me up. Let me see if I take these and those. Can I upgrade this? I only need the hardened steel plates. Because I'm thinking about making this, about upgrading this front. Like that. And that. Because the front takes most of the pounding. How many do I have left? One. I'm going to do just one. Let's, uh, well, there isn't any others in the middle, is there? All right, we'll just put that one back into the, uh, mobile constructor. But now my vessel should be able to take a bit more of a pounding, um, and uh, when I disassemble it to upgrade it to a higher tier one, it should be fine. Um, so I, I'm actually going to spend a bit more time over here disassembling things and getting more uh, hardened steel plates to upgrade my uh, vessel. But I'm going to call that an episode. So I hope everybody enjoyed the episode. If you did, hit that like button for me. And if you want to see more Imperion Galactic Survival, go ahead and subscribe. I'm Know-It-All DM, and as always, y'all have a good day now.